Hello, my beautiful Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. This is your favorite fortune teller, Divine Light. Today I'm going to do a coffee cup reading for March and this is going to be a general reading so take what resonates with you and leave what doesn't and if you like to see more of these don't forget to subscribe to my channel and if you enjoy these videos don't forget to give them a like. Alright now let's get into it. Before I start I'm going to let you know about this thing. There's a path opening for you, a long path, and somebody's coming, traveling towards you from this path. There's another one showing here, not very clear. This is telling me, like, there's another one, actually, towards the end of the month, another one, the beginning of the month, another one, and then the second week, it says 100% clear, somebody's traveling towards you, and I feel like this is like a tall person. They're coming. And this is for sure, the first one, maybe not that much and there's another path opening this is for you to opening towards the fourth fifth fourth week of the uh, of the month um you're gonna be traveling somewhere all right let's see what's happening inside your cup now i see a heart appearing here i see a separation maybe you're separated from someone you really really want you want to be with or maybe you guys had an argument because I see like somebody's leaning towards the other one and just yelling. So I feel like if you had this like um, argument with someone and your heart feels like there's a hole in it and you're not feeling full, there's going to be like um, another encounter with this person. Like you're going to be having another encounter here. I see here like you're coming together. And also like you're here, you're turning your back towards this person, but you still have um some things happening there's an energy surrounding you a white bright energy there's a letter a here so this might be in the first name or the last name of the person that you have you have this uh, this character and i also see somebody here dancing like their hands are up in the air so like um this is not the same person so somebody is going somebody else is going to be appearing in your life i see a letter t uh, as in tom and this might be in the first name of the last name of this person that um, is going to appear. Moving forward, in the first week, you're going to be having like these conversations about these people. I feel like this is a romantic thing. But this might be about your job at work. You might have this person had an argument with. Maybe you were just going to move on from this argument and leave everything behind within the first week. Beginning of the second week, I see a trident here. Tridents are symbols like the weapons of Poseidon, the god. So uh, I keep seeing this trident and um, this is telling me that you're going to be in a position of power. You're going to, you're holding this trident here and you have some couple people in front of you. And if you're having like a little bit competition at work, eventually what's going to happen is you're going to be the one grabbing this trident. You're going to be the one having the power. Um, you're receiving some things. You're getting some things out of this um, competition and you're the one being powerful i also see another person here a male figure and you're standing on top of his head so i might think i'm thinking that this person is going to give you a hand and go going to help you out to get that tried and get the power moving forward towards the end of this is actually towards the end of the first week let's say because when i divide the cup this is the end of the first week you're going to be getting this trident the first week as well and there's like two cups in between each other and i keep showing this cup ace of cups from this marcillion deck and this this is the ace of cups cups are um the suit of actually emotions like this is telling you you might get some emotional offer and actually two of them inside of each other so you might get double offers and um one of them is from this person with like a uh, very nice hair actually i see here like a male figure has good hair so uh, or like a female it might be a female as well with very good hair and um cups like i said emotional offer romantic offer but also, this might be something like a financial thing, which is going to make you very emotionally, you know, happy. Like uh, you're going to get the satisfaction that you're looking for. Um, this might be also about that, like a financial offer or maybe like a job offer, which is going to make you really, really happy. Move forward to the second week. I see like two one two people again you have so many people appearing this month like um 
maybe a friendship or something like that but you are above this person somebody in the past there's like another letter a did i see letter a here yes i did and there's another letter a um this might be in their first name or the last name this person is appearing in your life again and there's another letter m as in mary so and uh you might and then there's a letter h as in um harry so this person is appearing in your life coming towards you their hands are full actually he's holding on to one of the cups so this person might come to you with a love offer and he or she like the masculine side of um the relationship will be coming to you with an offer and um but you are sitting down looking down you're not really actually very interested because you have somebody else here with a male figure like a very specific like i want you to see this face like his face is very clear like a beard and he has a big hat this looks like a hoodie but usually hats um i interpret them as a in the format of uh like um authority somebody has who has a traditional job like a lawyer a doctor um engineer or someone like working in a company maybe like a banker uh, this person is very strong and powerful and he is actually behind you and supporting you that's why you don't really mind what's going on down there anymore it doesn't bother you it doesn't even like phase you i see the letter y as in yvette uh, so i don't really know any american male names or english um, but we have in Turkish last, but yeah, so this might be in the first name or the last name of this person that is supporting you. And towards the end of the third week, like the second week, I'm sorry, I see a letter T appearing here and there's like a snake figure. Also, the snake looks like, like, this looks like an ovary to me and there's like a baby inside of it. So like, uh, if you're planning to have a baby, this might be a sign. Or this might be a something brand new that you're going to be giving birth to. Like if you're planning to start your own business, do something new for yourself. Or this is like some sort of like a new attempt for you maybe. And this is appearing here. So like uh, beginning of the third week, you're going to have something new uh, happening. Uh, you're going to start seeing the signs of it, like new accomplishment. Towards the end of the third week, like no, in the middle of the third week, I see a bear-like person here. This is a tall, strong male and bears are actually uh, representative of authority, someone very strong male figures. So this person is standing right in your path, right in the middle of your path. And maybe this person wants to help you because I feel like they're not very, um, they're not really blocking your way, but kind of blocking because what they're trying to do is like they don't want you to go without their help so somebody is probably going to give you like some sort of forceful forceful help and i also see right under him there are two people they feel like i feel like there's something romantic happening in this thing so this person is actually trying to cover these people up as well maybe hiding this two uh relationship from you or maybe these are two people in your life or this is you maybe he's trying to protect you in and your relationship or maybe he doesn't want you to be in this relationship that's why he's just trying to um you know be on the way um well take what how it resonates because this was so specific i don't even know what this is so it just i just interpret what i see Let's see on the fourth week, I see, okay, I see people climbing up, um, like you're on a horse, you're climbing up the horse, like the hill with a horse, and then you're coming back down this hill. Um, I feel like you're going to be having, like you, if you're working so hard on your career and trying to make um, like progress and maybe get a raise or get into a different situation or a different position you are working and you're climbing that ladder up you're climbing that you're making it happen and it's paying off because uh like you're coming back down to uh, actually rest i feel like you're going to be resting and i also see two people here in a car traveling so you might be like um like here also you're dancing you have your dancing clothes and you're dancing you might have some sort of like a promotion in some stuff and this might give you a time to take off from work and uh, maybe um 
coming back down the hill, I feel like maybe you're just going to get the promotion that you need, which is going to help you work away from the office. Like maybe you're just going to go uh, start working in your home office or something like that. And um, this might give you the opportunity to get together with your loved ones and like travel with them to some places that you really want to go. This is showing up here and there's also another V here as in victory. So you're probably going to get some sort of a victory. And also there's like a whale showing here. Whales are the symbol of wealth and abundance. So this is probably going to bring you a lot of wealth that is going to give you the opportunity to be able to travel to the places you really, really desire. All right, guys, if you have a question, a desire, an intention, just hold it in your mind and let's see what the answer is going to be for that. Alrighty now. Okay, I feel like in your heart you had some stress, but whatever that you're manifesting is coming to you really fast. Like, there's no time left for it. It's just coming so fast. And I feel like this is something about, like, finances and money. Because this is in your heart. You have this financial thing in your heart. And there's, like, a, another whale, huge whale, showing up. It's gonna, like, gonna, in the beginning of the second week, you're gonna start seeing this whale appearing and your new horizon a new day starting a new adventure for for you but you are here again like you can see it's like a stop motion or like this is like a cartoon you know like the uh, i see um you know in the cartoons they draw each um scene separately i feel like this is like that is and like you're right here here, 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 you're moving, you're just climbing up this mountain and just getting over something. If you, like, this is something that you have been desiring and this looks like um, actually pelican to me, that bird with the huge beak and like, um, you're going to be eating that fish. Fishes are indications of wealth and abundance. You're going to be getting that fish that you have been working on and desiring. And I see like a zero, like two here and also a zero. So this might come to you in the 20th of the month. Like you're going to be receiving this huge uh, thing um, and in within this month. And you're climbing up this ladder. And you have another desire coming up here. That also is coming, but it has time. The first desire, the first question you have is coming much faster. And I see like kid, like babies here. So this might be something that you're new, um, something brand new that you want to manifest. Or if you're like, um, this is about fertility question, this might be also yes for you. Uh, there is another, uh, there's a crescent moon here. So if you have a legal thing, ooh, but this is this tiny little thing. This is not a huge thing. It's showing up here as well. There's a full moon appearing, so and there's like a little um, opening here. These are indications of wish fulfillment. So in the beginning of the month, you probably get another small wishes that you have, a small wish fulfillment that you have. And this looks like letter C. So C and O, we can say if you have uh, like a desire, something like a person or a situation, these might be in the first name or the last name or the name of the place that you are want to go and the thing that you want to do. All right, guys, that's all for today. Hope you enjoyed this reading. If you do, don't forget to give it a like. And if you want to see more of these, please subscribe to my channel. Have a magical day. Bye.